everybody, hello and welcome to my Mark II Ford Focus ST. We are fresh out of isolation, me and my fiance. Let's get down for this corner. Just get past this Mr. Mercedes Sunday driver and slow down. We are fresh out of isolation, and as I said, fresh, fresh out of isolation. Just completed 10 days. And the first thing we're doing is going out in the ST, why not? We're doing a very YouTuber thing to do, and that is I'm taking my car to get Starbucks. That's what we're doing. We're not going to our local Starbucks, we're going for a bit of a drive out. We're going to get a Starbucks, and then we're going to enjoy some country roads through this wagon. I've missed this car. I have missed this car. So as I said, we'll do a little bit of talking. We'll get some cinematics at Starbucks. We'll probably pull over, try and find somewhere good to take some nice pictures of the car, some nice cinematics. A bit of country lane driving. And that's us, that's what we'll be doing today. So you will enjoy. Stay tuned. AYP, that's who it is. Right, so we're all Starbucks out. I didn't really get uh, even the picture that I wanted. Just to get out of the way. Oh, there's a TV behind the petrol station. So I didn't get the picture I wanted and I didn't park near a window. I just couldn't park near a window so I couldn't even look at the car. So I didn't really get what I wanted. But the coffee was good. We're now going to go and see if we can find the driving road for the way home. I want to pull over and get some pictures. He pulls. So we found location one for pictures. Look how well she looks. From the, we are at Cliverall Castle. I think you can see it just behind me. I'd like to get up and in front of the castle. For now, I'm just in front of this beautiful big building. I'll insert a few pictures of what we've took so far, but I think with the trees and the light and the thing, it looks fucking mint. Although I don't think I don't think we should be up here. The sign said for deliveries only. Let's look at her. Do cinematic. Right, so we've got a few pictures and cinematics, we've moved it into in front of the castle. Look at this for a view. Pendalo, Pendalo, where the witches were hung. Come on then, let's go and find some more driving roads. Yeah. <laughs> Taking 
outside uh, Cliverall Castle. That's where where we are in the world in Cliverall. It's a fucking beautiful little village. If you've never been, you should definitely come. If you're in in the northwest. Um, so, in a recent video where I sat down and had a chat, we spoke about an epic petrol-led road trip. Uh, but I didn't really lead on to too much of what it was about or what I was doing or what we were doing. But uh, a two-day road trip planned. We're in the northwest of England and on the first day we're going to be travelling down to Silverstone. Now it's not for um, it's not for like a track day or anything like that, it's to go to the museum. So that's going to be one video, travelling down to the museum, including the simulator. Uh, and then from there, and the bit that I'm probably the most excited about is going to Caffeine and Machine. But we're going to we're going to be going to Caffeine and Machine to spend the night, uh, and hopefully we'll see some awesome stuff there. Then from there, the day after when we get up to travel home, we're going to be stopping off at the British Motor Museum. So that's going to be another video, and that's going to be our two-day road trip. So it's about. I want to look at this driving road. Isn't it? to Silverstone Museum, one night stay at Caffeine and Machine, followed on by a trip to the British Motor Museum to see all things motoring and great that are British. So I hope you enjoy them, make sure you stay tuned, there'll be about three or four videos there that we'll make throughout that course of that weekend. Um, so yeah, enjoy. So we just kind of stumbled upon really like a bit of an epic driving road, I don't even know what it was called, if I can find out what it was called I'll put it on the, in, on the screen in the description. Guys, just behind us, um, here we just pulled over for a few more cinematics and a few more pictures more than anything in front of the um, the autumn leaves and there's some trees over there so we'll park up in the trees. But more importantly, the places where we've the place where we've ended up here, this building behind us here is our wedding venue. This is where we're getting married, September. So eight months from now, we'll be here. In this building, getting married, so that's kind of stumbled across it. We didn't plan to come here, but it's nice to get out here because it's we've not been back because of COVID and lockdowns and stuff like that. We've not been back to see the venue, but it's here, so we'll get some cinematics. We'll have a bit of a nosy ourselves off camera and then we'll get back on the road. And we'll see. Absolutely epic. We 
are following this animal to take us back towards our old farm. What's that dog called? Hod of cloth, looks like a nice one. Look at this. Who would have thought this is in the northwest of England? You drop me in the Lake District, I believe you look at this bridge. Just walking through mud to take my ST for a Starbucks. I just stand on the road. You can see it's just behind me. This is our final spot where we've took some pictures. So we've been to three locations today, which I'll put a link in the description if you want to come and take pictures of your car. But here we go. Look at that. Look at that for a view to finish off with. Who knew that there was such some amazing, beautiful driving roads in, in the northwest of England? So we're in the, the forest of Boland is where we visited to drive through There's some epic roads. I'll try and find the names, I'll put them in the description. Remember, we want on that road to a thousand subscribers. Make sure you press that subscribe button if you already had not Comment down below what road you would like to see me to do. Definitely going to be taking a trip out to Wales this year for the Evo Triangle and a few roads through Snowdonia, Black Mountain Pass, things like that. Any road you want to try, me to try out, I will certainly get on a road trip this year. So, as always guys, hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Take care.